Hello YouTube, this is Dom this is Dom Data Be Creative and I am here this Saturday just to do a quick short video on a project share. I am in a collab with Four Spices hosting it and it's called a Stuff It Collab. And I will help all of the lovely creators, um, collaborators, creators, whatever you want to call them, in the show me box below. So definitely check out the channels and subscribe to them. You will be inspired. So the whole purpose of this um, Stuff It Collab is to make a purse, box, or bag. So that's the subtitle. Stuff It Collab, purse, box, and bag. That can be stuffed with different things. And so, um, you know, so I'm making, trying to make mine useful. I'm trying to make it when I need a box to make it for something. And so I have been commissioned to make some birthday arrangements in purple and silver. So I decided to use that for my project for this month's share. So I will show you the items that I made. And real quickly, what I made it's very simple it's for a birthday party. And just so um, I show you that real quick. So this is a die that is. Um, oh my gosh! I just forgot who made this die. Uh, even though I think that's the scissors number but anyway it says beautiful and this is the one you, the second piece that you cut out the letters for the word beautiful and uh, that die I got it from HSN off of Clarence they had a three pack of three word phrases like this for like ten bucks or something uh, last year anyway and then I got this of course from TM and this is just a quick envelope die for this one you will need to have long plates if you're going to use something like the coda bulk you have to have long plates so, I mean you could tape it down and take it out and spin it back around but it's easier if you have long plates or I use this in my big shot um, or you can use it in your Gemini or something like that so just know that it's a, a longer die see how long that is so it's easier like I said with a longer plate you can run it through your cutter bug with that and then just gotta make sure you tape it take it back out and then run it back the other way so you can technically do it this is a three piece die so you have a, um, this has holes in it like a string and then that the set of pieces like you see right there so I was asked to make some birthday goodies I got a little small budget she told me what you want me to do Car colors was purple and silver so um, making some of the items that she wanted me to make and she wanted me to make some candy bar wrappers and stuff so this is just the outside bag that the candy bar I'm not finished with those yet so hopefully I have a chance I don't know if I'll come back and make another video but they're going to go inside of here so of course the envelope is functional and well, I'll type that those, I can show you that. But anyway, this is the outside of the envelope. And it's a small party. Um, it's for 27 euro and um, eight. Everything I have to make is for eight. So this is the little envelope that's going to house the candy bar wrapper. And it just says beautiful. And so again, the silver and purple are the colors. And so I use the second layer of the silver over top and I put the silver under the word U. If you actually cut out that you can actually keep those letters for the word U if you ever need it for anything else. Um, but I thought they turned out really cute and so they are all the same. So that is part of what I'm making um, for her, her party. So anyway, so that is my look over well. And it's also, this is the tag because initially I was going to make this and then put her letter, her initial on the girl's name, uh, initial on it with the twine. Then I decided, uh, I mean, that's cute. You know, it serves its purpose and, uh, but I wanted to do something a little bit more on it, so I did that. So anyway, um, that's how that looks. So I'm going to save these pieces because I may make something else with it. Um, but anyway, so thanks for liking, watching, and subscribing and I dare you to be creative. Take care. God bless. Bye-bye.